Hey, welcome to Mad Dog and Merrill's Midwest Grilling. I'll tell you what, we're gonna have a wonderful time here today. We are in, uh, we're in one of the campuses for Feeding America, and today we're gonna Feed America, and you're gonna help us do that, ladies and gentlemen. It's a galathon, so we're gonna have a little gala grilling event. We're gonna ask your a couple of little favors as we go along, but as always, great grilling. Great grilling. Fast Freddy on the we'll keyboards, right ladies and gentlemen. Fast Freddy. Louisiana Grills presents Mad Dog and Merrill's Midwest Grillin' Feeding America Special. Brought to you by Louisiana Grills and Smokers, Pit Boss Grills, America's Pork Producers, Healthy Homegrown Wisconsin Potatoes, Sundrop Soda, Awesome Shrimp and Seafood, Cherry Delight, Shooting Star Casino, and by Lashbro Aerial Images. Welcome back to Mad Dog and Merrill's Midwest Grillin'. Well, I promised you a great time, and that's exactly what we're going to have here today. Uh, we are with our good friends, Feeding America, Feeding America Eastern Wisconsin. And uh, we're joined with Patty Habeck, Hob who is president and CEO of the Eastern Wisconsin uh, version. And, and, and the website right away? www.feedingamericawi.org. And the reason we're asking that website is because we're going to ask, ask your help. Every year you guys put a, a, a gala mm -hmm. event on, and it's a fundraiser. Mm -hmm. It is our fundraiser. It's our biggest fundraiser of the year. It's where we make our dollars to really purchase the food that's needed by the families in need. So we're having a, a gala-thon. A gala gala a gala -thon. I like that. <laughs> Everybody I like can that. have a telethon. We're having a gala-thon, and, and we're going to ask you to go to the website, uh, uh, feedingamericawi.org. Uh, if you would please, and, 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 and help us if you would please. Now, the Better Business Bureau, uh, uh, Patty, I'm gonna jump right into yeah. it. Uh, you know, uh, people uh, ask about uh, fundraisers and, and giving money and everything else mm -hmm. because it's a, it's a question. Right. Yeah, we're a highly efficient organization, and so we've been recognized um, and accredited by the Better Business Bureau as well as um, Charity Navigator. We're, we're a four-star Charity Navigator organization. Isn't that great? And, and, and at a local level here. So we had a chance to visit the, 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 the Fox Cities campus. Yeah. And what a great facility. And oh, it's amazing, the warehouse. We haven't even seen the warehouse. Uh, this is just the, uh, uh, the, the, is this the sorting, the clean room? This is just our volunteer area. So this yeah. is where we do all the sorting of food. And if you'd go behind the walls, you would see uh, another um, 70,000 or so square feet of oh. warehouse and inventory space where we do all our storage of food. And just to give you an idea, back in 1982, they started out with the first donation of 600 pounds of apples. And where is it? How many millions of pounds a year now of not just apples, but everything? Just under 60 million is what we distributed last year. <laughs> oh, 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 just, <laughs> just, just uh, under 60 million. But of course, no, no, Eastern Wisconsin, we're talking how many counties? 35 counties yeah. uh, across the eastern side. So it's about 65% of the state. Yeah, and, and from what I understand, it's about a half a million folks, half a yes, million or so. Half, you a, help? half a million people are in need, and we help yeah. through about 400 food pantries. Yeah, yeah. and it's not just, it's, it, it, it's folks that are not just down and out that they don't have a, a job it's people who and, and adults older folks like ourselves <laughs> and younger people with kids who have an income but it only goes so right. far right it's just some people um, have a hard time making those ends meet the cost of um the cost of living right now is so high yeah. and so sometimes they just need a little extra help and that's what we're here to provide yeah so should we get some grilling in? I'd love it. All I'm right. Ready for a gala. I am. I, I, <laughs> gotta I, gotta grill first. I am grill too. First. Exactly <laughs> right. So so Meryl's going to do some beautiful Argentine red shrimp, and maybe you can help right. by pouring that into the uh, that yeah, lovely dish. Yeah, absolutely. Isn't that pretty? But you know what? That isn't just Argentine shrimp. That's awesome shrimp. It yeah. is. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. You know, when you're doing it on shrimp on the grill, the main thing I want to do is just oil this first before I really start with the seasoning. I want to put a little oil on there, mainly so that it'll brown up really nice. So it won't stick. Easy to do. We've got some regular ground ginger here. I got a little basil. Put that on there. That's going to be flavorful. Yeah, isn't it? Yeah, ginger and that basil. Kind of that's perfect. Yep. A little teriyaki. Not and a little you're, bit. You're a griller at home, Patty? Um, I, I grill somewhat, but my husband's the expert on this one. Yeah, good for you. Oh. Yeah. A lot of people during the pandemic started grilling. A lot of people during the pandemic have uh, more needs. And yeah. we just got through with that and, and the prices of inflation, everything else. Yeah. So I imagine your needs are a little bit more here. A little garlic pepper yeah, there. Yeah, with the expenses right now that families are seeing in their households, it, yeah. you know, they really have to think about yeah, um, recipes citrus. to how they can stretch, stretch their food dollars. Yeah. There you go. I want to mix that all up. 
be able to put this on the grill. It's going to be good. Garlic and citrus, yeah. You, know, you should let it sit for a good hour or so before you put it in there. But make sure that you've got plenty of oil on there so it'll brown up really So, well. and, and, and you know what we're going to do, we're going to throw those into a, uh, this is actually one of the great sponsors. And in your gala, uh, our good friends at Louisiana Grills yeah. uh, donated a, a beautiful uh, a pellet grill, like the mm -hmm. ones that we cook on this year, Louisiana Grills. Uh, they're doing a nice pellet grill. So one of the one of their excess. Freddie, would you like one of these baskets? Well, oh, now these are these are a grill walk. I'll use one of those. But what about Merrill? Oh, he can't walk like he I used to. I can't walk like I used to. <laughs> oh, geez. I can run quite a way. I can run. There you go, Freddie. I waited all day for that one, Patty. All day, that's a good one. That's a good one. <laughs> Hold on the camera, everyone. Just stay where you're at. Don't worry about me. There you go. <laughs> don't worry. Don't worry. So those Patty, volunteers, good, volunteer wise. Uh, you go through a, a slew of volunteers every week. We're talking uh, two shifts of 40 every day, so that's 80 volunteers every day at both campuses. Absolutely, yes. Totally. Um, and, and so if you're looking out there and watching this and you want to volunteer, just go to our website. We'll help you out. Beautiful. And the website again is? www.feedingamericawi.org. So the pork that we're going to be doing there you today. Go, sir. Yep, okay, good. Oh, beautiful. We're going to get that ready right for yeah. the walk. Mm, I like that. There, we'll set that baby right over there. Now that goes on the uh, Louisiana grill. Uh, the pork, we have a, a couple of pork tenderloins on right now. Mm -hmm. We're gonna cook those to 135 degrees. Uh, the shrimp gets put on the grill. We're gonna put them in that wok uh, and put that on the grill in Louisiana grill. We're gonna set that temperature for about 280 degrees and same as what it's on there now for the pork right. and cook that pork for about 40 minutes or so at the most. But the pork tenderloin, I'm gonna be a smarty pants. Oh, I'm a, oh man. look at you. I know. <laughs> Watch this. So 40 years and forward. 40 and forward. We're a 40 year old organization yeah. and we're looking to the future. Yeah, isn't that great? And the staff wise, you have a lot of volunteers, uh, but you have staff that, that, that help out at both facilities. We do, we have the best staff actually that help out at both facilities. So we have um, drivers and we have um, our warehouse team and we have um, our operations team that really helps keep us going. And they're really uh, upbeat too. I mean, everybody's just friendly, every easy going. Even Tony and Jessica are upbeat. <laughs> even Tony and Jessica, can you imagine? Yep, exactly right. <laughs> But then Kat's putting them in line today, so she's doing a great job. So I'm going to put a little, uh, that's uh, blackstrap molasses on oh, top of it. I know. And then we're going to put a little bit of our spicy barbecue sauce, Mad Dog and Miro's spicy oh, yeah. barbecue sauce. Now the Pork Association, we actually uh, uh, got together with, with six different states this year. And it, uh, uh, the name of the website is pork.org. <laughs> it just came to me right off the top. That's what I said, and then I forgot. forgot. <laughs> it's pork.org, but the, all the Midwest states got together for the Pork Association. They don't, uh, donate a lot to Feeding America. Yes. And, and, and along with our good friends at Wisconsin Potatoes, I know they do mm -hmm. also. They do. So we're going to squeeze a little lemon over the top of that. We've got the barbecue sauce. We've got the molasses over the top. And, and what we're going to do is we're going to slobber that together. <laughs> And when you see the ones that are coming off the grill, they're just a beautiful mess. It's just great. Love I'm going to take that glove off. We're going to take jarred garlic. Ooh, yeah. got to have Ooh, garlic. Huh? Yeah, you got to have a whole garlic. bunch of jarred garlic. garlic on top. We have rosemary, because mm. when we put it on the Louisiana grill, and I know you guys don't cook on a pellet grill at home, and someday you may, but when you put it on a Louisiana grill, nothing really burns unless you want it to with the searing station. Right. It okay. slow cooks, and everything, you can make it as gnarly as possible. So we have a little thyme on top of there. Boy, that looks from delicious. There, the Doesn't that look really good? Yeah. Yeah. Now, the only thing I'm going to do is put a little brown sugar over the top because I got that molasses on there, and sometimes that can either make it sweet or take away from the sweetness. So we're going to put those on the grill. We're going to take that off at approximately 135 degrees. And because we're doing a gala -thon, we're going to do some nice <laughs> little hors d'oeuvres yeah. uh, with cocktail rye cheese and a sauce we're going to make the next segment. So it's going to be a wonderful time. So anything else we left out here, Patty? No, I think, um, you know, the big thing with Feed America Eastern Wisconsin is food brings people together. You guys bring people together around food. And so it's really, you know, interesting that, that you're doing this show with us because we're trying to bring people around the table so that everyone has food. And, and we're foodies and we can afford food. Look at no one's yeah. starving right here. No <laughs> one's losing a meal. So we have to help out wherever we can. And one dollar donation, one dollar donation gives, gives approximately four meals. It is. I find I, that amazing. It's, a, it's something we're really proud of, and yeah. that is because we really maximize every donation, and we work with so many different vendors and to make sure that we can get that price down. Yeah. 
So, so if you can go, if you would, please, why don't you get the website one more time, and we're going to ask you to look it up as we're as we're into a commercial break here, yeah. and maybe you can help us out because it's a galathon. Galathon. Gala yes. It's www.feedingamericawi.org. Yep. And get, get your little organizations together, do a little volunteering. If you're a corporation, do a food drive, do a fundraiser. We'll be right back. Thank you, Patty. Thank you. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Freddy, 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 everywhere we go, where's Freddy the Piano Man? <laughs> you know, we, uh, we have a great time uh, when we do the tapings, and, and I'll tell you what's another great time is uh, just before well, we were setting up, there's a group of volunteers behind us. They're setting up for the gala tonight, uh, but there was a group of volunteers, and I couldn't have heard more laughter and fun and, and gaiety going on like you wouldn't believe. Well, yeah. you know, we're in the big city here. We're in Milwaukee, That's and if you go to watch our show, you know where we're at? 9.30 on channel 18. CW is super 18. And on Sundays. Yep. But I'll tell you what, you folks out there that are watching this show, a lot of times this is like a public service. We're, help, we're helping out with Feeding America. Right. This show may not be aired at our normal time, so go to maddogamero.com to find out where that listing may be. It's a fun show. It's a great show. We have a good time. We travel the, uh, the countryside. Uh, but today it's uh, feedingamericawi.org. And if you're not in Wisconsin, if you're not in eastern Wisconsin, if you're in eastern Wisconsin area, 35 states, uh, and you go to that, that website, that's how you can donate. Uh, otherwise, for you folks out there, and I know we're listing about 35 states and 140 markets, uh, go to feedingamerica.org, feedingamerica.org, if you would, please. But the shrimp is on the grill. It's looking delicious. The pork is looking delicious. Take a little look at that. Isn't that good stuff? Oh, uh, yeah. Man, oh, that's good. All right. Whew. So, Meryl, you need a sauce. Hey, I need a sauce. I love sauce. I'll tell you what, I love using this as sauce. This is one of my favorite sauces here. Still works. Show the label to the All fine right, camera. That way there, not to me, to the camera. There, there. Can you see that? Can you see that? We got her. Thank you, thank Did you. Did you see right. it, Freddie? Shrimp on the Barbie. Shrimp on, shrimp the, Barbie. on the Barbie. I'll this tell you what, a, not just shrimp, phenomenal. but we'll say it again. Uh, 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 awesome <laughs> shrimp, awesomeshrimp.com. Cold water shrimp, as good as any lobster you'll ever have, folks. And it's awesome. It is awesome. <laughs> Got some horseradish. There it is. Got some garlic. Best shrimp dip you'll ever have. I'm gonna, you, you keep doing that. I'm going to show I'm you a little job. That. You I'm just keep working, lemon. Meryl. You're doing a great job. Fresh squeezed lemon on there, Freddie. I mean, this really put the icing on the cake. It makes a That's difference. It, it does. It does make a big difference. On so you folks can go to the grocery store, and you can buy this red stuff that's Whoa. a dye, <laughs> and it's got water, and it's got high fructose corn syrup, and a little bit of tomato puree and some other stuff that they won't mention. Or you can get Mad Dog and Merrill's Del Works, add Good a little point. lemon, horseradish, garlic, and Tabasco. Tabasco you got man. the best shrimp dip in the world. Or you can go to the store and pick up this yeah, if you want. Yeah, no, you'll love it. You'll love it. You Trust won't lose me. my respect. Oh, uh, well, you'll lose mine, for guys' sake. <laughs> Gooseberry. <laughs> Gooseberry. Gooseberry. Gooseberry was banned in many states. Did you know that, Freddie? Yeah, I told you before, I stocked up in case it happened there. So the, 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 the gooseberry is a lovely little uh, tart. Uh, uh, it looks like a grape, it looks like a currant, it grows on okay. a nice little bush. Uh, they're green as a rule, uh, and, and there's red ones also. But it, So it, it, it's, a, it's a gooseberry, and, and people make jams with it. And instead of orange marmalade or something a little bit different, to top our pork, we're going to take a little gooseberry jelly preserve. I'm going to add a, a little bit of curry in there, because we want a nice good oh, curry I love flavor. Curry. I love curry flavor, and a lot of times people don't do enough. So right. we have the curry in there. Uh, we're going to add some nice garlic. We're using a lot of garlic today, and I apologize, but we love garlic. I love it. Uh, some good old-fashioned balsamic vinaigrette. I want to keep the consistency. You know, brought up a good point. A lot of people don't use enough curry. It, that's a, that's you know, the whole I point. Really hate people go, oh, there's, there's, we'll put a little, you know, teaspoon. I mean, use curry. Up north, pepper. That's a beautiful black pepper blend with onion and garlic. We're going to use a whole bunch of that. So in at the gala event, and I'm sure here tonight, uh, they're going to be serving some nice little hors d'oeuvres. And that's kind of what we're going to be showing here today, is doing a nice little hors d'oeuvre with, with a gala little event, gala-thon that we're having here today. Now you folks, and I'll tell you what, that pork tenderloin, we're going to slice that baby up. Ah. The shrimp gets topped. We're going to top some things in a moment, things you don't want to miss. But first, while we're on this little commercial break, you go to either feedingamerica.org or feedingamericawi.org respectfully. So we'll be right back, ladies and gentlemen. Fast Freddy on the keyboard. All right, Freddy boy.
<laughs> Got it right on. Hey, welcome back to Mad Dog and Barrel's Midwest Grillin'. Today we are feeding America, and that's what we're doing here today. Uh, two great campuses in the eastern Wisconsin area, one in the Fox Cities and one in Milwaukee, sandwiched in between. <laughs> <laughs> Merrill and Freddie is PJ. Yeah. Every great nonprofit agency has to have a mascot, and this is PJ. Stands uh, for peanut butter and jelly. Thanks for explaining oh, that one, Freddie. I thought it was Paul and Julie. <laughs> <laughs> Darn it. They, uh, hey, we're having a good time here today. I'm going to tell yeah. you one more time. Uh, uh, one dollar, one dollar can supply four meals. These, these are people in your own neighborhood. Yeah. Right, these exactly. Are, and the people that work here, the people that volunteer are in your community. These people are around you. These people are, are, are people who are looking for their next meal to feed their kids, to feed their grandparents, to feed whoever it may be, and, and they need your help. And, that, and that's, right. what it, that's what a galathon is all about. Our galathon is all that's about. That's right. <laughs> uh, it, it, it's trying to raise some money for these good folks, and good folks that they are. Both campuses, the nicest people we've ever met. We are. They, everybody likes it. Everybody's just happy. Everybody's go-getters around yep. here. Good to the place see. was just jumping this morning. It really yeah. was, and, and, the mo and the most fun they ever had. I'll guarantee you that. Okay, you ready for the unveiling? I'm ready for the unveiling. PJ, sir. not if you're ready for the unveiling. See, <laughs> see. I'm even nodding. And I'm not even. So, PJ. so when you take and you cut a, take a piece of pork or beef or whatever it may be, uh, and you you got to smother it, and that's what Patty said. You know, Patty said her husband and they they don't smother things like they should. And, and that's what we're doing here today. We're actually sitting and we're smothering that meat product, which helps to hold the juice in. And anything, anything, nothing is worse than a dry piece of pork. Oh, but when pork right. is done to perfection, it's the best cut of meat that there is. It really, really is. Uh, so we're going to take our pork, and I'm going to take a slice, and, and, and just beautiful pink oh, nice perfect. juices on you the inside. It. And what we're going to do is create little hors d'oeuvres. So I'm gonna slice up. Do you want to finish up the crackers? I too will now? finish up the crackers, sir. Oh man! On this side for our shrimp, we've got a little bit of horseradish cheese on Ooh. there. Ooh! So those are little uh, Newton Brit those Britain crackers, aren't they? Britain. Britain crackers. Britain Thank crackers. You. They are. They are little cucumbers. How's your eyes, Freddie? Okay. There are. Okay. okay. All right. Right. Let's cucumbers save a on anyways. there. Okay, I will. Just for you. <laughs> Top that. Over here, we got some horseradish cheese. That's for the pork. That's going to be good, man. I'll tell you, I'm excited. Well, I'll tell you Look what. At that Let's pork. do some That's pork right beautiful. now. The pork it turned out just apps. You, 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 this pork is so delicious, it's going to be phenomenal. And we're going to do a few of them here. So we're going to take our slices of pork. Those go on top of that nice cold okay. cheese. Meryl, wow. you did a good idea with the cucumbers on I top know. to protect it a little bit. I'm going to melt mine a little bit. Oh, man, that right. pork looks delicious, doesn't that it? That is perfect. It really is perfectly done. Use a meat thermometer. Yeah, yeah. Keep on, I hate saying that, but use a meat That's thermometer. That's absolutely for true. Sake. So we'll finish up like that. All we're right. going to take a little bit of our wonderful sauce. That's that gooseberry sauce that we did. And we're going to top each one with a little gooseberry. So I these have are gooseberry sauce, Freddie. Yeah, oh, yeah. It's been years. We haven't lived till gooseberry. No. Nope. Saving mine. <laughs> You're saving yours? <laughs> no, Freddie's uh, favorite is some capers. I love capers. I love capers. So You're just a, a caper few capers to finish yet? that baby off. I'm uh, learning. Okay. So I'm going I'm to stop right there because I don't want to run out of time. All right, so so, you, so yeah. our nice little, uh, uh, our pit boss uh, grill wok turned out lovely. The shrimp turned out great. Wow, look at that. Yeah. I'm walking till I can get home and get, to, get my walk going He's and do my shrimp. Ladies and gentlemen, so we're going to take that, that beautiful Argentine and shrimp, that, awesome man. shrimp, just... and we're going to place that on top of there. Oh, you don't mind I'm doing this. Do you, Merrill? I'm just messing around here. Trying no, to get no, it done. go right ahead. I'm just uh, a little bit of the DeWorks mixture, Merrill. Yeah, man. yeah, you got to have that. And that is perfection. Yeah. Freddie already took a sample. Oh, was it? Yeah, it's yeah. delicious. It really is. You want to make sure it wasn't too hot. Yeah, it doesn't take much. Nope. Good. Lemon really makes a big difference in that too. Jalapenos? I love a little bit of jalapenos. I know Freddie does it, but. Yeah, so we'll do a few jalapenos. These are diced up jalapenos. Beautiful. There you go. Don't forget to go to the website, ladies and gentlemen, uh, 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 feedingamericawi.org. These are green top onions? Yes. Yes, sir. Scallions, green tops, green tops. There's a little, anything that? we missed? I think it looks lovely. I love it. The pork turned out delicious. Everything, for some reason, turned out just lovely. It did. I don't know what that is. What do you think, PJ? It looks good? PJ the, uh, agrees. 
Yeah, and we have PJ. We all want to thank. We want to thank Patty, of course, for being with yeah. us here today. That was very nice of her to take a little time. She was president and CEO of the Eastern Wisconsin uh, uh, Feeding America. The campuses are great. Everything is great. It's yep. phenomenal. It really is. Go Quite online if you would, please. Mad Dog and Merrill's Midwest Grill, and we'll be right back to wrap this baby up. So whether you're a corporation wanting to do a food drive or a fundraiser, whether you're a local organization wanting to volunteer, or individuals wanting to give $1, $10, or $20, please do so, ladies and gentlemen. Go to that great website, feedingamericawi.org. We'll see you in part two of Feeding America, ladies and gentlemen. Part two is coming up. Mad Dog and Merrill's Midwest Grillin' is a production of Lashbro Visual Communications.